Come here. Uh, have a seat. Uh, have a seat. Sit your bad self down. Bless you. Bless you. Uh -huh. Good morning. Good morning. Cheers, love Cheers, you. Cheers, love you. Good morning, everybody. Howdy. How is everyone? You sure I'm not chopped off on the top? I'm sure you aren't. Okay. So you're doing that on purpose. No, I'm just Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, good morning. It's a lovely morning. Yeah. Yes, I mean, yes. Yes, it, it is. It is. Hear the birds. It is. They're all happy. It it's is. It's springtime. Everybody's happy because it's finally springtime spring here time. in northern Nevada. <laughs> Most mornings we get up, it's winter time when we get up. Only for him. <laughs> and maybe my sister. <laughs> she's, she's chilly all the time. Uh. So, well, good morning. <sighs> Happy Mom's Day tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Happy Mother's Day so, weekend. Happy Mother's Day to all of the mommies out there. So um, we just got an invite to go with our daughter to dinner tomorrow Oh, the rest of the family's not coming? I guess we're just our going daughter, with Jolene. And our son-in-law <laughs> and our grandsons. Yes. Gosh, you have to be sassy all the time. Scott and the boys don't get to go. They get, yes. they get they sit out in the car. Are you kidding? Alex would not permit that. That's true. He's going to steak. So, <laughs> he's going. If he has to dress up like a girl and be a mom, he's going. He's going to get his steak. He's going to get his steak. <laughs> yep. Get his steak on. Well, thank you everyone for joining us today. If you haven't subscribed yet, please make sure that you do and make sure that you click the little bell to get notified every time we put out a video. Please give us a thumbs up and share the video if you feel it's entertaining enough or, Give us a comment or you below. just want to get rid of it and send it out there yeah. say share i want you to share in my misery you want to get even with someone <laughs> yeah. send them this video that's right i don't like you today watch these guys <laughs> so last saturday we did a live it was very impromptu and we're sorry for all the people that we missed we got yeah. several messages hey i missed you i'm sorry so. But you know, you can always go back and re-watch those lives. Right, you just don't get to have yeah. the fun of participating. So, we were naughty and had two Saturday travel days in a row. Yeah, so. someone scheduled it that way. We're not really sure who. But somebody in this household scheduled two travel days on a Saturday. Yeah, it starts with T and ends in OM. Um, <laughs> so, but we, we enjoyed... You know what, I will say this. What? Maybe I do things like that, but marriage with you is very educational. Truly educational with this one. I had no idea there was a specific way to put milk in a fridge. There is. It's got to go in just the right spot. <laughs> you, know, you open it up, you shove it in there, you close the door. Uh-uh. has to be in the correct fridge because, remember, we have two. Oh, geez. It has to go in just the correct one, and it has to have the handle turned a certain way. <laughs> It's like all the labels in the pantry have to face, face the front. Out. Well, yeah, so you know what's in there. Gosh. That's why I always open the door as I walk by the pantry and just turn two or three of them. Yep. When he has the peanut butter, he always makes sure he puts it back in backwards. I don't always. I just, however I pick it up and I put it back in there. Oh, my gosh. And you make sure that it's facing backwards. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Anybody else have a little anal retentive? Um, that that would be me being anal about oh, how okay. all the labels have to face forward and the milk's got to be in the fridge mm. the right way. And anyway, yeah, you have to pull towels a certain way. So it depends. I see those pictures on Facebook every now and then. You know, it's like which way is the right way? Where you just fold it in a square or you fold it in thirds? It depends on where you're storing them. It gets back to the old, age old question. How do you put your toilet paper up there, over or under? The U.S. patent on toilet paper shows it going Here over. Here it goes. That's you know, personally, way. just set it on its end right there on that the floor. That works for me, too. That, I mean, <laughs> I know people say that's just terrible, but hey, it works for me, too. I don't care. As long as there's toilet paper there, that's what all that really <laughs> that's matters. That's the main thing. That's the main thing. So thank you, everybody, who joined us for our live last Saturday. That was a lot of fun. <clears throat> yeah, it was. And... Uh, 
we got to ch check out our new light that we got yeah, yeah. Um, for an evening, yeah. you know, when it was getting it seemed darker, to work so okay. It seemed, you guys could see us pretty good, right? Um, so uh, Sunday and Monday, we just kind of had a chill kind of day. I don't even remember where we were. Were um, we still in Yarrington? Let's see here. <clears throat> yes. We were in Yarrington yep, because at the Sagecrest Drive-In Movie Theater. Yep. So Boondocking. We, uh, we had a couple of nice, just relaxing days. I worked on um, a scrapbook that I've been working on for almost 20 years. Yeah. <laughs> Seriously. Our, our trip to, to Fiji. Fiji. I'm finally getting some more pages of that done. And yeah. uh, it's, you know, it's kind of low priority on the to-do list. So <laughs> since I didn't really have any other things that had to be done those days, and we were sitting it was like perfect time for me to get some more pages done in it. So it'll be awesome, you know, when we get to finally see it all finished. But it was fun going through I and hope seeing I live long pages. enough. I know. I'm that slow with it. <laughs> that one in our Disneyland one from the same year. Oh my God. Anyway, I had fun doing that. You were playing with video stuff. Yeah. Listening to music to use and different ideas and putting stuff together. And uh, on a Sunday, <coughs> it was a day baseball game mm -hmm. and uh, the Cardinals won finally oh my gosh they had such a drought this is just a horrible season for uh, them so it's, it's just, just fun watching baseball yeah period. we just love watching baseball but they're and, not in it and <laughs> and you know every time there's a mishap or the other team scores we're like oh my god <laughs> oh my gosh it's like why'd they do that why'd we love playing that? armchair manager oh yeah yeah we know better <laughs> we do I know um, better. I know do. better on a lot of things. That's true. You know what that kind of makes me think? Do you, Lori, do you ever just sit back and think, wow, my man sure knows a lot. Maybe I should just be quiet and listen to him. Hello? Hmm? I'm... I'm still here. I'm being quiet and listening. <laughs> oh, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yikes. So on Monday, we just kind of uh, went and ran a couple of errands. And we had to go to the grocery store and fill up the truck with, with fuel. Mm -hmm. And uh, it got pretty windy that day. Yeah, it did. That day. It Again. Got, yeah. And of course, you know, we like to park near hills where the wind comes <laughs> blaring down Sweeping the hill. Sweeping down the hills. <laughs> Yep. But the Cardinals won both those games on Sunday and Monday. Yay! Yeah. Two-game winning streak. <laughs> Here we are six weeks into the season. It's oh. the first two games in a row they've won. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yep. Well, Tuesday was a travel day, and we went from Urington to Minden mm -hmm. to get our refrigerator fixed. Minden, Nevada. If you're new to us, we have two individual Dometic refrigerators. And we had one of them that would not stay lit on propane. It only liked being on electric. And hey. since we like to pro we like to boondock, since we like to boondock, we wanted to make sure it worked on propane. Ooh, yes. Ooh, 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 pick me. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Tom. <clears throat> what were we talking about? The refrigerator. Oh yeah. Um, <laughs> and I troubleshooted it and figured it out. But I just needed that extra mm, to say, yep, you were right. This is what was wrong with it. The so expertise. We, the expertise of yep. a friend of ours who is a mobile RV technician. And yep. sure enough, that's what it was. It was the uh, thermocoupler. The thermocoupler. And it would light. It just wouldn't stay lit. Yep. So it just, it, it was all crusty and burnt out. So he fixed it. Replaced in like it, 10 put minutes. a new, new one in. In like 10, 10 minutes. minutes. Yep. So, yay, it was fixed and it wasn't a huge, huge expense. And, oh, well, we already did the huge, huge expense yeah. on the refrigerators a couple so, years ago. And then they're so, working fine now. They're working yeah, knock fine. Yeah, knock on wood. Knock on wood. So, um, we got that fixed, but um, he has a lot of property, so we asked if we could just stay the night there. Because we um, had some business to do. We had some business to take care of in uh, Carson City, which is a half an hour away from Minden, 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. Um, so we went and ran those errands, and we went and had lunch, and the fridge was fixed, and all was well. 
And uh, then on Wednesday, we had a travel day. Another to travel day. Our summer home. To our summer home. <coughs> Hello, studio audience. <laughs> Speaking of our summer home, <laughs> our summer home hosts. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thank you so much to Kevin and Wendy for allowing us to just plot down. Yes, we love it. And Kevin is absolutely amazing. He made this area for us yeah. even bigger. You know, he did it just for us. We we know that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he made this area a whole lot bigger. It was a whole lot easier for you getting backed in here. Yeah. Because uh, we used to come in a certain way, and now we can just go shoop, right how, in. How did shoop, we go? Shoop. Shoop. Mm -hmm. Instead of shoop, 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 shoop. <laughs> That's what we used to have to do to get up here. <laughs> Not, anymore. Not anymore. I mean, it's all Not flat anymore. now. <laughs> so, yeah, so it's it's nice. Um, and we are very appreciative of getting to yes. hang out here. It gives us a chance to visit our family and friends, mm -hmm. get some projects done. Instead of being somewhere where we're a little bit iffy if we can do it there. Yeah. And um, so we are very happy to be here. Uh, to Thursday, we needed to go and I needed to get lab work done. Um, you got yours done in prep and I wasn't able to then and so I got it done. Man, yours was fast too. She got it done and the next morning it was like the results were posted. Yep. Yep, I went in on Thursday and we got the results yesterday. Yeah, it's crazy. So now we are all ready for our doctor appointment at the end of the month. Our annual's coming up. Yeah. It looks like green, maybe yellow light for me, but green yep. most of the way. Yep. <laughs> I've got one yellow issue, but uh, <laughs> eh, it's something that's been there for a long time. So, um, so you know, we had our travel day. We've been getting to um, visit with family. We after my blood, because my appointment wasn't until ten thirty, and after fasting, it's like I hadn't eaten anything since like dinner since six thirty the night before. So we ran straight lines to go eat. To eat. So we went and ate, and then we we ran. actually didn't go to Denny's. We didn't. We went to International House of Pancakes. <laughs> I haven't heard it called that in years. Because I'm not lazy. <laughs> International House of Pancakes. So um, we went there because for one reason it was right next to Costco and we yeah. had to go into Costco. So uh, we haven't been in a Costco in been months. A long, been a long time. Months. Probably since we left Hasn't here. changed much. Yeah. Well, no. <laughs> just had to remember the layout. And... Uh, so we went there. I wanted to get some of those great big locking bins, clear bins that I use for stuff that's going into storage because a lot of stuff is going into storage. We're going to empty this puppy out. Big time. I mean, pretty much empty it out. Big time because we have some big plans this winter. <laughs> yes, so. we do. And we'll reveal those big plans <laughs> very soon. But this is going to blow a lot of people away when you find out what we have planned. That's why we have to get this emptied out. Yep, yep. So, um, so yesterday we just kind of finished mm -hmm. setting some stuff up. We got mm -hmm. you know our mats out and our barbecue grill. I cannot wait to have some grilled chicken because we don't pull it out when we're just stopping every other night yeah. or every couple of days. We just don't drag it out because I have to have it cleaned to put it away. I don't yeah. like putting it's it away all the face just the right way. It does, and it has to be in its plastic bag, and <laughs> yeah. So, so I got a couple loads of laundry done yesterday, and we're just here. And here we are, just and chilling just, out. We're going to start uh, check marking all those things off of our to-do list, and there's, there's few quite pages. a few pages. Quite a few. <laughs> a few pages of to-dos. Quite a few projects. So, so I went and hung out with my sister a little bit while you were watching the beginning mm -hmm. of the ball game, and my brother-in-law had taken his mom to an appointment. So yeah. <clears throat> I got some little bit of sister time alone, with sister time. So we're just happy. To be so here. coming up on what up Wednesday this week is what oh, yeah. the gold field? I believe it's the gold field. I can look it up and yes, find out, be. but I believe it's I when we it spent. Be. A few days in Goldfield because we always go through there and we never stop and we always wanted to stop because it's an old mining town. Yeah, it just always looks so cool and um, they are very uh, proud of their history. They preserve their buildings or they don't even preserve them but they're still historical, have historical markers on them mm -hmm. and they're still left standing. So Coming up Wednesday the 17th, Goldfield. We are the 
we RV'd in a living ghost town, basically. Because it is. I mean, it's yep. still a pretty vibrant little town. I was kind of shocked because I thought it was mostly that, you know, dilapidated. and yep. But there's a lot of stuff going on in Goldfield. But we'll you'll see it Wednesday. Yes. So it was, that was that was fun to go walk around and do yeah, that that day. Yeah, it was. And the reason we stayed there for a couple days is because we needed to stay in an RV park so that Bear and Kaylee would be comfortable and safe and not us boondocking somewhere. And when we were in Goldfield, it was summertime because we had to run the air conditioner <laughs> all the time. It was a little on the toasty side. Yep, it was warm. It was warm. <laughs> So now we have a beautiful day today, so mm -hmm. we're going to get some work done around here. Yep. I think you need so, to get busy. Yeah, uh, we do. And the first order on your list is feed your husband. Just like you feed the pigs. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get for being so demanding, you little, you know what. <laughs> All right, everybody, have a great week. See, See ya. ya. Take your banner and raise it. Bear Bear, good morning Bear, good morning, good morning puppy, you ready for breakfast? Oh, ooh, breakfast. Let's go eat.